file server is a traditional location where businesses use to store their documents, files, and folders. Due to the advancement in technology, storage, and security that cloud-based platforms provide, enterprises and large-scale companies are moving towards SharePoint. Kernel migration for SharePoint is a strategic tool for businesses operating with Microsoft 365 as it allows transferring data to SharePoint from File Server, Google Drive, MS Teams, OneDrive for businesses, and public folders. The tool is compatible with all Windows versions including Cloud PC and Windows Server ranging from 2003 to 2022. Now let's delve into the process of migrating data from File Server to SharePoint. Press Windows key on your keyboard to open the search bar and type kernel migrator for SharePoint and launch the tool. You will find two windows on the left side of the pane named Source and Destination. The source will show options like Windows File System, Public Folder, SharePoint On-Premises, OneDrive for Business, Google Drive, and Microsoft Teams. On the other hand, in the destination, there are options like SharePoint On-Premises, OneDrive for Business, Google Drive, and Microsoft Teams. Right-click on the SharePoint option in the destination wizard and enter the details asked including project name, select either of the add single site or find add multiple sites. Since in this video, we will be adding multiple sites, so we selected add multiple sites option. When you click on this option, a new wizard will open asking for details such as central admin URL, central admin username, and central admin password. Enter the details and select Next. This will connect you to the SharePoint server. Select sites from the site collection that you want to move your file server data to and press Check Accessibility button. Once you find the accessible sites, click Finish. Click OK and select No from the pop-up asking to add the same SharePoint server as source. The sites are now added to the destination. Click Documents from the site you want to migrate to and then select the files you wish to move to SharePoint site. Right-click on the selected files and then select Copy to and then SharePoint. This will take you to a new wizard asking to select the targeted URL. Now select the Browse button and then click on Lists and Libraries. Click on Documents from the window opened asking for Target List and Folder. Then press the Next button and wait while the tool is retrieving the data. The new wizard will show you the mapping, check it once and then press Next. Select the desired filters and press the Next button. Again, click Next after checking the permissions. Now, you can either select Execute Immediate to Migrate right now or select Schedule to Migrate it later. Check the checkbox to generate detailed log report and select Next. The pane will show you the migration summary in detail. Go through it once to see if there's any amendment needed and click Next. It will start the migration process. Once the migration is completed, you will see the process summary. In the end, click Finish to end the process. To learn more about the file server to SharePoint migration in detail, visit the given link to our website. Thanks for watching the video. Have a great day.